Hello, welcome to IT Security Labs, and today we are doing day 22 of 25 in this advent of the Cyber Challenge. We're learning information security skills, and today we're learning blue teaming skills. So we'll be talking about Cyber Chef, then we'll also talk about All Dump, which is a really wonderful tool for looking at documents or files on your system. So first, you need to start your machine. In our target machine today, there is going to be a file that was left there by the Grinch Enterprise. And our goal is to look at that file to see how malicious it was and be able to identify some flags and answer some questions. All right. So looking at the desktop here, we have tools. And in the tools, we have CyberChef. So I would open CyberChef and double click on this. All right. In addition to that, in the tools, we also have all dump. So to be able to interact with this all dump tool, I'm going to be using the terminal the command prompt. So I open the command prompt and then uh, CD to the desktop tools directory and there's all dump there. All right. So now that we know how to interact with this, please read through this. Uh, we do have some options that we'll be using here. So it says to solve this challenge, you need to find the stream that contains the script. Select the macro stream number eight and dump the contents by running the all dump minus s minus lowercase s that's the stream number eight then minus d that's the dump raw contents so it says the grinch enterprise left a malicious document on the machine and you are you need to find it all right i will find it lucky for us it's not that hard to find if you go to the desktop there's a santa claus naughty list here's the document here all right so we're not going to open the document we're just going to interact with it using all dump so what we can do is you can just copy this document from here, drop it in the tools directory, and once you paste it, it should be here. I like this document here so that I don't have to deal with Windows command line. All right, so now that the document is here, we can run all dump against the file. All right, this syntax we were given. Okay, so, so let's look at the stream number eight, and we're given the syntax here, minus eight, Minus S8 minus D. Minus S for stream number 8 minus D. Very interesting data. This looks like base 64 looking at the end here. So I'll just pick maybe starting here. I'm going to back it in CyberChef. It's base 64. So we would like it to be from base 64. And then let's just paste it here. The decimal number 35 will be our XO. R key. Okay, so with base 64, this is what we see. We need XOR. So in the drop down is decimal from base 64 again. All right, so if we apply our key of 35 here, of that. All right, so <laughs> after removing all that noise, we do see some interesting information here. What is the username, email address? Okay, so what is the email address here? So I see a password there as well. What is mailbox password that we found? It's right here. What is the subject of the email? So the subject is this one. What port is the script using to exfiltrate data from the North, North Pole? And you find 587 here. What is the flag hidden found in the document that the Grinch Enterprise left behind? Okay, so we, we need to keep looking. This was stream number eight that we interacted with here. Let's clear the screen, rerun our command. So what we can do is we can start from stream number one, or we can start going up from eight to seven, six, then we can go nine. So let's do seven here, hit enter. And so this is the stream right here. All right, so we found our stream. There is another second flag somewhere. Can you find it on the machine? So we need to just keep looking. So we are looking in the, so this is the desktop. Do they have anything in the downloads? Oh, okay. So in the down, it's not. <laughs> I thought it was in the downloads. Okay. Documents, nothing. Pictures. Oh, I do see a picture. So I'm just browsing around and here's flag two. I cannot copy this. So I need to type it in. All right. So as you can see, I just went ahead and typed this one in. This is a capital L. 
make sure to type it correctly and we got the challenge done if you like this please make sure to like and subscribe otherwise i will see you next time